Hmm. Gusset. Hey there. Huh? Yep, yep. That's the shop. New things. Nice. What do you think, Yamagishi? Do you sense anything? No. Uh. By refusing to speak, you're only hurting yourself. We aren't trying to keep you hostage. We just want to avoid unnecessary confrontation. How's Shidori? You're back again. Why are you so hung up on her, Junpei? Did she say anything? Not a word. Let me talk to her. Yori, you're getting really emotionally invested in this. Is everything all right? Well, I know she attacked me. I don't know. I, I just can't get her out of my head. Please, let me do this. Call for desperate measures, I suppose. All right, see if you can get through to her. Got it. You okay? <sighs> I'm glad they let you keep your sketchbook. Wow, you're still drawing pictures? Even in the hospital? You really do like to draw, huh? It doesn't matter. She spoke to him. Only I can understand my drawings. Wait! Shidori, your arm! It's bleeding! Duh, not again! Yamagishi, get the doctor. What happened? What? She does it to herself. I thought I took all the sharp objects in here. She did this to herself? Apparently we can't leave her unattended for even a moment. At the very least, she seems to heal at an astonishing rate. Let, let go of me! And that cut on your hand back at the station, you did that to yourself? I never asked for you to worry about me. You were the one who jumped to conclusions. Well, I want you to stop. I can't be doing that. I'm not just saying this because I'm worried about you. I don't want to see you hurting yourself. All right? The doctor will be here soon. You should head back. Right. So, you seem to have found your voice. Things may have happened, but we're going to buy things at the store. Wherever the nearest staircase is. I need more courage, but hanging out with people is more important, unfortunately. Hi there. How many months are left? Um, just a month. by five. Oh Awfully God. unuseful. Hmm? No, I'm sorry. Actually, don't I need something? Well, first of all, get rid of this one. Second of all, do I have the one for you? No, nope, have one moment, please. Um, justice. Hmm? Oh, quite a lot of... 
Just ignore it. Just ignore it. Just ignore it. You can ignore it, can't you? I'll, f I'll forget. Totally. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Please take a look. Is this acceptable? Very well, it's yours. Are you finished? We look. We are absolutely fine. We don't have to go over there because we don't have one. Second. Could you hire a real child, please? Hire a real dog. Thank you. What's wrong? It's okay. You can come down now. I I can't get down. I it's too high. I shouldn't have climbed up here. The dog in the jungle gym was so scary. I thought I was gonna die. Thanks for helping me, Mister. Welcome back. 
I haven't seen your message. Sorry, did you say check on who? Save that game. <laughs> we'll not have to redo that. Hello. Two double exclamation marks. Yes. Oh, Senpai. Can I help you? How have you been? Uh, well, I'm okay. Why are you asking? You aren't worried about me, are you? If so, thank you, but I'm totally fine. I'll do that. You're really caring, Senpai. Thanks for going out of your way to check on me. I'll do my best not to worry you. Well then, good night. You started. Come to think of it, I haven't had dinner yet. I should probably eat something. Um, Senpai, you wouldn't happen to be hungry, would you? Welcome! Take any open seat. <sighs> He's not here. Oh, uh, it's nothing. You wanted to eavesdrop on him? Sorry for asking you to go out all of a sudden. I just wanted someone to come with me. And it's a little intimidating going to get food by myself. People tend to stare when they see an elementary school kid like me out on his own. Your order. Two regulars coming right up. Thank you. Hmm. Looks like there's a special ramen too. I wonder if that's what most people get. You don't have to copy everyone. So, I saw some people from our dorm stop by here a while back. Like, Sonata-san, and that guy who recently joined. Aragaki-san, do you come here with them too? What kinds of things do you talk about? Oh, sorry for asking something so weird. I just thought I should know a bit more about everyone, since we'll be fighting together from now on. But it's good either way, because I've always wanted to have a proper chat with you. Everyone in the dorm is amazing, but you're on a completely different level. I can't believe how many personas you're able to use. Here you are. Ikutsuki-san and Mitsuru-san said that each person normally has only one persona, and that it doesn't change. What an animation. That means, what I saw back then, was really... Uh, it's nothing. Sorry. Shall we eat? Oh, I finished all the soup, too. I'm stuffed. Phoenix Ranger Featherman R, the Melancholy of Swallow, will air this winter as a TV special. Whoa. Huh? Wow, a spinoff with Swallow as the main character. I gotta make sure I record that. Yeah, it is! This is big news! Swallow doesn't usually make much of an impression, but there's a theory that he's actually stronger than Hawk! Uh, I, uh, heard that from a friend. TV shows like that seem to be popular in my class. <laughs> I only watch them, so I have something to talk about. <laughs> anyway, it's been a while since I've enjoyed a meal like this. I guess it's because I'm eating with you. You're really easy to talk to, and the ramen was delicious. Maybe next time we could... <laughs> um, it's nothing. It's getting late. We should start heading back. It was delicious. No, this food was not delicious. Don't let yourself think like that. Hey, Amada. You on your way home? <laughs> Us too. We just finished eating dinner. Oh, are you from the same class, Amada kun Another point to Japan only has ten English voice actors. Yes, it's nice to meet you. Oh yeah, Amada, you gotta join next month's soccer tournament. Soccer? We've been waiting for you, you know? We can even practice together after school. I'll have to pass. I'm not even sure if I could make it next month. Oh, come 
on, we can't win without you. You're better than all of us. Because he's taller. You can't pressure someone like that. Can't you see you're bothering him? I'm sure Amada Kun has a lot going on. Isn't that right? Oh, no, it's fine. I'm sorry. Please excuse us. You should hurry home too, Amada Kun. Home. Come on, let's get going. Your grandma is waiting for us. But mom, if a mod is <sighs> sorry about us, that. We're gonna <sighs> get totally free. No, it's not that. I just have enough to do. The second semester has already started, and we have to go to Tartarus at night. I know we'll be going through a lot from now on, so I decided to not make any promises. More importantly, sorry for keeping you out so late. Let's make our way back to the door. So smart. Yes, dog? Do you need something? That voice. It really is you, Koromaru. I'm so glad to see you again. I was worried when I didn't see you at the Shrine Gate. But here you are, looking better than ever. <laughs> and so well dressed. You've become quite the fashionista, haven't you? Oh, good boy. Good boy. Do you live in the store? Is Koromaru in good hands here? Oh, I thought so. By we, I take it you mean everyone in this dorm looks after him. I'm glad you found somewhere you can relax again. Oh, don't you worry about a thing. You can live wherever you choose. I have to get going. Take care now, the both of you. What's wrong, Koromaru-san? Oh. I see. So that's what's troubling you. That woman from earlier, she offered to take Koromaru-san in at one point. But at the time, he still had unfinished business to attend to. Of course, she is unaware of that fact. So in all likelihood, she may still carry the wrong impression about Koromaru-san's feelings. Everything all right? Would this happen to be about Koromaru? Don't worry, I understand. Sometimes you don't even need words, right? He's such a sweet, smart boy, isn't he? So really, I'm all right. But thank you for being so thoughtful. The way he's by your side. He looks just like he did when he was with the priest. He must really trust you from the bottom of his heart. Please, take good care of Koromaru. Koromaru 
really has been blessed with so many wonderful friends. Be sure to cherish them, okay? You'll be at that dorm from now on, won't you? <laughs> well, I'll have to visit you again then. Please don't pull you around every day, Karamaru. Oh, here we go. About four days. Hello. <laughs> How would you know? Keep watching. you to speak with me. Could it be you? I'm nothing. Hmm? You've been seeing you. Could it be you? Good day. Are you accepting a request? <laughs> Very well. Um. Could he have more things to sell me? reason to up my courage ever again. Just the truth. Attention, please. Mm-hmm. So that's what... Huh? I, too, speak yes. English. No, no, no. I want smartness. We just confirmed our answer. Yo, Chitarita! Don't call me that. <laughs> Come on, lighten up! Here, I brought you a new sketchbook. I thought your old one might be getting full. I don't remember asking you to do that, Junpei. <laughs> Finally called me by my name. I wasn't sure if you'd ever say it again. Hmm. Hmm. Any luck? She finally started talking, but she hasn't said anything useful so far. Well, it's a start. More of a response than we got from her. So, why are you here? 
Shidori? What's wrong? Hmm. What is that? There's something right there, an enemy. Wrong. Move. <sighs> Shidori! They change you from bills. Relax. The persona just went berserk. It happens. It happens. Weren't you guys watching? You could see her persona strangling her for a second. They're not like us. They can't fully control their personas. That's why they need to take suppressants. To keep their personas from killing them. Suppressants? Wait. Do you know something about Strega? Some things you only pick up stepping off the straight and narrow. I'll give the duck the meds I have. The rest is up to you. Shinji, wait! Hey! I Junpei. Thank God. I thought you were gonna die. What do you mean? Why do you look so scared? Death is nothing to be afraid of. What are you talking about? Dying just means you won't wake up tomorrow. That's all. What the hell are you saying? You don't really mean that, do you? Junpei? I don't want that. You hear me, Chidori? Junpei. It doesn't matter if you're not afraid. It's not the point. I don't want to have to live in a world without you. Junpei. <laughs> you're so weird, Junpei. <laughs> Look who's talking. Wait! Shinji! <sighs> what the hell's going on? Why did you have those suppressants? <sighs> I've heard about what they do. They're taken to rein in a persona when the user can't control it. But the side effects... <sighs> You're not taking them, are you? <sighs> Me. I don't have to tell you shit. Why are you always like this? Save it. I've heard it all before. You think I'm wasting my power. You can't stand the sight of someone so half-assed, right? I'm sick of your damn preaching. <laughs> shit. You don't understand at all. You should already know. Ten years ago, when the orphanage burned down, I couldn't save my sister back then. I wasn't strong enough to get past the adults holding me back to even try. <sighs> That's why I try so hard. I thought you felt the same way. We promised each other to become strong enough to do what we think is right. So why? Why'd you start taking those drugs without telling me? I'm back in the fight now. I have no reason to suppress my persona anymore. So just let it go. Damn it. And the side effects. Hmm. There's something I need to take care of. It's something only I can do. I gotta take responsibility. What do you mean? Listen. Quit worrying about me. Just do what you think is right. Got that? Shinji. Yes. Greetings. This is questionable. It's called reading into the quotations. Hmm. See, problem is, you are number one. Yeah. Hey, what do you want to do now? Karaoke? Mommy, where are you? 
Hmm? <laughs> the one child mother. Hey, what's wrong? Are you lost? Mommy told me to wait here. And, uh, uh, she gave me money, but uh, she, uh, she's not going back. Hey, don't cry. See, you're okay now. I'll stay here with you, alright? We can get help over there. Come on, follow me. The policeman will know what to do. He'll find your mom, so don't worry. Whew, what a relief. I'm glad he was able to contact the parents. What were they thinking, leaving that poor kid all alone? Stuff like that really makes me upset. But I guess my own mom's no different. Yeah. Why do you want to know? Sorry, I didn't mean to poke fun at you. Remember what I told you before? How my mom and I aren't very close? Well, if you ask me what kind of parent she is, I'd say a terrible one. She wasn't always like that, though. After what happened to Dad, she totally changed. She's probably living with one of her boyfriends somewhere. Honestly, I'd rather not know. Anyway, I'm done talking about this, okay? Could we keep this between you and me? You're the only one I've told. Three already? They take forever anyway, so... Sorry, I'm not in the mood for karaoke anymore. Let's go home. But is karaoke something people just do? Unfortunately, no one's trapped in it yet. I shall not let go. Oh, you. I have Hello. a suggestion. Oh, you have my. We do have a lot of money. Yo. By the way. Hello. Sorry, but um. There's one specific machine that sends that that that, 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 um, that has the thing, and I don't know where it is. Hmm. Let's see here. Hmm. It's probably academics, and that'll do other things. My courage, courage, you. Um, never mind. Time for academics. I only know one area. Actually, any more things I may buy? Come on. Hello. What does it actually do, though? Well, either way, I didn't buy it last time, and neither will I buy this time. Nearly Sunday Morning. today. You yeah. think I know more than you? Well then. Why is this class being taught? No. 
Okay, then. I'm sure I'll get just fine on the quiz. Alright. Unfortunately, everyone's getting overshadowed by the teammates. What? What? And then added a bunch of citrus. You know, just some simple light flavors. I want your honest opinion, okay? H how was it? Oh, I thought you might say that. Oh, thank you, though, for being honest. Actually, you don't look so well, leader. <laughs> Cooking. I just figured that I could count on you for an honest opinion. Well, uh, thank you for your time today. I'm going to keep at it. I, I should focus on making it edible first, though. Hooray. I forgot how boring nights become. There is nothing to do. Oh, welcome. No one's been captured. And I have to raise my academics. Hmm? This is the worst thing that could possibly happen. This time in particular, I believe this human is goodbye. Is this why you got rid of the upside down? Our next topic. I need to be looking at this. I'm too bored. We need this academic. So I've been thinking about a new schedule. No one else is gonna be here today, but they said we still can't give you back your evoker. I wasn't expecting them to. That's why I'm in here in the first place. Oh yeah, uh, how's that cut doing? Yeah, right. Probably healed already, huh? So, uh, you're not drawing today? Does it matter? Well, uh, not really. Huh, your flowers wilted. Uh, the heat must have got to them. Oh, I know. Why don't I go buy you some fresh ones? What's your favorite kind of... Hey, 
Well, what's wrong? <sighs> huh? Yeah, those are cut flowers, right? Oh, how'd you do that? I gave them a little bit of my energy. It's not very good. I didn't know your healing powers could do stuff like that. It's like a miracle or something. It's nothing special. You have powers too, don't you? This is just another form they can take. Well, yeah, I guess. But that's about all I've got going for me. Without this power, I'd be a nobody. I just talk a big game, pretending like I'm some kind of hero. But in reality, I don't know what the hell I'm fighting for. In fact, I don't even really have a good reason to live. A good reason to live? You're still young. Good reason. When I was a kid, I had this silly dream. A dream? I used to want to grow up to be a pro baseball player. Pretty stupid, huh? But I guess that's part of being a kid. I wouldn't really know. I don't remember much from my childhood. I only remember one thing. Being surrounded by white. Everything was white. Hmm. I hate hospitals. Oh, you do. Um, sorry. But you've been coming to see me here, so I don't mind as much this time. Chidori. Did you mean it? Then I'll come to see you every day. Dash. Hey there. Hello. Great. Oh, you're back. Hello. So, who's in the TV today? Ah. Yay. Okay, um, let's go. 